Welcome to the California Science Center. I'm Bill Nye, the science guy. It is an honor to be here. I am thrilled. Well, when I was governor, I approved a master plan for the California Science Center, and I'm very delighted to have a world-class science center in uh, California. The goal of the Science Center is to stimulate curiosity and inspire science learning in everyone. We do that by creating fun, memorable experiences. Welcome to Magic Science Evolution. We are Penn and Teller. We've wanted to do something uh, with the museum for a while. Put us in the Science Museum. We're here at the California Science Center. Magic, the science evolution. It took about four years to develop the exhibit. So we felt people could have fun with science while at the same time enjoy this fascinating world of entertainment magic. This is a wonderful place to bring children. I love it. You are about to be launched on a journey. This week, Thousands are taking a lunar trip at the California Science Center. Uh, we're the only place in the West to see an actual Mercury, Gemini, and Apollo command module. It's not all the time that children here in the South End get a chance to have one-on-one -on -one time with NASA's astronauts. That was awesome. She sailed into history on her maiden voyage. Now the doomed ocean liner Titanic is about to go on display. If you come here, you get shivers up and down your back. These are really fabulous exhibits. We tend to have very ambitious goals and always want to do more. What's really unique about our Science Center is the combination of the hands-on exhibits and experiences, challenging minds of everybody who visits the Science Center. The California Science Center School will bring state-of-the-art education and technology to the community. I was especially excited with the idea of having a public school married to the Science Center. The California Science Center is offering kids from LA's inner city a chance to expand their brain. We opened our Science Center School and have been very successful. This class is really cool. Let me ask you about the Science Matters programs. Many people don't understand a lot of the basic science. We're all passionate about science. We think it's fun, we think it's interesting, we think it's important to our lives. Sign your kids up fast for hands-on science camp. That's going to be the best thing in the world. Science is really the foundation of learning. It's the annual California Science Fair. We do science fair once a year and 900 of the brightest students in the state of California come here. The real winners, of course, the generations that will benefit from the brain power in this hall. I love science. Science is what I want to do when I get older. You know, I can't really explain the passion. It's just I love science so much. If we can only get a small percentage of the young people that come through here interested so that they become tomorrow's scientists and educators, uh, we've done a great job. This place makes a difference. We have 1.4 million people coming through here every year. An exhibit featuring dozens of human cadavers has been drawing record crowds at the California Science Center. We also were very proud to be the premier in the Americas of the Body Worlds exhibit. It was incredibly successful. The center will remain open through the night. Oh my gosh, the line wrapped all the way around and round. And we decided to just come back at 6.30 in the morning. But if you don't get a chance to see it, there's another display, Body World 2, with all new specimens. I saw the lungs. They were, like, all so dark. You shouldn't smoke because you can lose a lung. What's happening at the California Science Center? The science behind comic book heroes. The idea of combining fantasy, imagination, and science all in one exhibit. It's a great idea. The Star Wars fans will almost certainly be flocking to the California Science Center in this coming months. A new exhibit explores the links between real science and the popular sci-fi movies. How did you end up with George Lucas's uh, trilogy? And science fiction often leads to science fact, and the exhibit is perfect for our mission. It's very exciting, the thrill of seeing all the real costumes and models and things from the movie, but the most fantastic things you can think of actually can be real. There are over 100 artifacts that were supplied by Lucasfilm, and they were all actually used in the movies. We've also developed some fantastic traveling exhibits. Most recently, we developed an exhibit called Goosebumps, the Science of Fear. You can engage in a fear-inducing activity. You can lie on a platform that suddenly falls back. You're, like you're actually falling off something, yeah. You can measure your fear, can understand what's happening in your brain at that time. This is an exhibit that will make your heart pound. Republican Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger shared the stage with Gray Davis and former two-term Republican Governor George Duke Majan at a groundbreaking for a new ecology project at the California Science Center. 
Our second phase of the Science Center, which is World of Ecology, is going to be better than anything we've done yet. It's just been a wonderful experience for me. It is very clear to me, this is an exciting place to be. Happy 10 year anniversary! I'm very proud of after 10 years being the most attended museum in Southern California, and we've accomplished an incredible amount. We still have a lot to do.